afternoon and welcome back to my channel. I'm Debbie from Debbie's World and this is another Slimming World weigh-in update. So I didn't come on and do a proper vlog last weekend. I did quickly update you on my weigh-in result at the end of my food diary uh, but then I didn't end up having time over the weekend to film a proper update. So I've got two weeks worth of results to update you on. So as you know, if you've been watching me for a while, I am a Target member. Um, I try to consistently follow the Slimming World plan. Um, on the whole, I am very consistent with it. I count sins, I weigh things. I... But sometimes I also have a little bit of flexibility. So um, I might not always count a cup of coffee. For example today I've had a cup of coffee in Costa uh, with some skim milk that I might not necessarily count. Um, sometimes I have a handful of cereal that I might not count but that would go towards Savvy Sins. So I wouldn't say I'm absolutely 100% on it all the time. I let myself have some flexibility here and there. Um, so for the last last week which was the 1st of May, I gained three pounds, um, which left me at 11 stone and half a pound with a total loss of 15 stone seven. And then on the 9th of May, um, which was Thursday, um, I gained half a pound. So I now weigh 11 stone one, with a total weight loss of 15 stone six and a half. Um, so I am pleased with that actually. Um, I know it's two gains in a row, but I think this is my pattern. Um, I think I'll always do this. I'll always have two or three losses that get me to the bottom of target, then two or three gains taking me back up to the top and then hopefully losing it again. I don't seem to find that very flat line but as long as I'm somewhere in my target bubble then I'm happy. I don't know if you can still hear or still tell but I've, I've also had a bit of a cold for the past couple of weeks so I've been feeling a bit tired. I've taken a bit more time for myself, I've done a lot of reading, um, a lot of time playing games, just just having a bit of time out and also a bit of preparing because we are going to the Lake District very soon. Um, so I've written all my lists out um, and I'm going to be doing a big batch cook next weekend so hopefully I'll be able to film all or some or all of that for you um, although mostly it will be things that I've um, done before like crustless quiche and curry loaf it will be things that I've cooked before um, but I will try and film at least you know the basics of a Slimming World batch cook um, I've, al I've also been planning some of the walks that we're going to be going on, me, Andrew and Charlie. We are um, stopping in a cottage. Um, I will hopefully, as long as the Wi-Fi is as good a standard as last year, I will hopefully be vlogging um, our holiday, um, which is coming up soon. Um, yeah, so and also a couple of weeks ago I had a, sorry I'm a bit all over the place today, I had a sickness and diarrhoea bug um, about two weeks ago just before the weigh-in where I, or was it three weeks ago when I lost three pound and then gained the three pound back. So I think some of that's had an effect as well and I also think, I do believe now I'm at Target, I do believe that our monthly, my monthly cycle is affecting or not or um when I have a gain or a loss you know that could have could be some reason to do with it just fluid retention because fundamentally I do follow the same eating plan each week as you'll probably have picked up and while I'm on while I'm on I know I haven't done as much on YouTube these past couple of weeks but if I'm ever not uploading videos please do go over and check my Facebook page Debbie on Slimming World or my Instagram at Debster underscore SW 
uh, details will be at the end and in the description box and you'll probably find either stories or pictures um, saying what I've been eating and my weighing results and things like that. I do tend to do one or the other so I'll either be filming for YouTube or I'll be taking pictures and doing things on Facebook and Instagram. So do go over and check those out if I'm a bit quiet here on YouTube. Um, and also I'm on Instagram, I'm on something like 9,250 followers. So if you're not already following me, please go over and follow me because I am hoping that I'll get to that 10,000 followers mark on Instagram and be able to do a giveaway. I also picked up at group the Slimming World Free Food on the Go, which was on offer with the last uh, countdown. And obviously the, that offer's now run out and we can buy the booking group. Um, but I had to wait for my consultant to order it in. And there's, there's some things in here. I might change a couple of the things that I plan to make for my holiday and make a couple of these things that are in here. Uh, because these are really good for like packed lunches and like the veggie pakoras or what was the other one? Egg and pork pies. A lot of these um, recipes in here are free on the plan. Uh, ice and style roast chicken. That looks really nice. Now I'm not, not going to be able to say this. Tamagoyaki omelette rolls. Now you know I like my egg based things so that looks really nice and a bit of something different. <coughs> I'm just looking what that's got in it. It's just got carrot, eggs, soy sauce, chopped spinach, spring onions and soya beans. What else? Mini meatloaves which I've made before. Oh and this. Crustless squash mini quiches, that, they look really nice as well. So let me know if you've got this book and what recipes you'd like to see out of it. But this, these crustless squash mini quiches are butternut squash, baby leaf spinach, red pepper and brine, spring onions, eggs, pickle baby beetroot and lettuce leaves. So they look, and that's to serve the beetroot and lettuce leaves. And they are free. Would they be SP friendly? Yes, they'd be SP friendly as well. So yeah, let me know what you'd like to see. And if you've got the book, do comment below what uh, what you'd like to see. So that is me maintaining in my target range for over seven months. It's just come up on my time hop that in a week or two, I'll be celebrating reaching one of my targets, which was 12 stone. Um, so I'm really really happy that I've managed to maintain well under 12 stone for a year and I've been maintaining at 11 stone for as I say about seven months so really really happy um, so as you'll see from the title this is my Slimming World Vlog 100 now it's not my 100th weighing update because when I'm doing month, uh, when I'm doing daily vlogging, I do my weighing updates and I don't number them. So obviously, I've had more than more than a hundred weighing updates. I hope that makes sense. I'm actually on week one hundred and sixty-one. So that's probably about right because I've done about four months of. Um, daily vlogging and in the daily vlogs I'll do my weighing update and also I didn't start YouTube until I was about eight or ten weeks into my journey. So yeah this is vlog 100. So to celebrate vlog 100, to celebrate maintaining my first target of 12 stone for a year and in memory of Alfie who in a week, in a couple of days, it will be a year since he sadly passed away and went to live at Rainbow's Bridge, which is um, a place our dear departed animals go to wait for us. Alf is my border, our previous border terrier, if you don't remember. So in memory of Alfie and to celebrate 100 Slimming World vlogs, I am doing a little giveaway. So as you know, I was very, very lucky to be sent 
a huge supply of tasty little numbers bars which are available on Amazon and I have three more boxes to give away. So funnily enough they are 100 calories each so I thought they'd be very fitting to do uh, with my to give away on my 100th vlog. So we have 20 white chocolate tasty little numbers biscuit bars, 20 milk chocolate and 20 dark chocolate and they are all gluten free and they are described as a tasty little crispy crunchy biscuit wafer dipped in dark white or milk Belgian chocolate. 100 calories or 5 sins on Slimming World. So to enter my giveaway you must be a subscriber. Uh, you must comment below and um, I'm going to leave this running for a couple of weeks because as I say I'm going to be on holiday so I'll actually draw this draw this giveaway in roughly two weeks today um, I forgot what else I was going to say I said glu naturally gluten free tasty food in smaller portions um, Oh, and it's UK only because obviously um, they are quite pricey to post. So yes, UK only. I'm not going to be putting giveaway on the um, title. So only the people who watch, watch this vlog uh, or watch my videos on a regular basis will have a chance to win. And also, um, again, when I announce the giveaway in the vlog, um, I'll be expecting the person to get in touch with me within a certain time and I won't be chasing the person I'll, I'll, I'll be expecting the person to have watched my videos uh, sorry if that offends anyone but I really want my prizes to go to someone who's faithful to my channel who watches my videos regularly so there we go I want, as a thank you for sticking by me um, I'll be celebrating what will it be? Three years on YouTube. Um, yeah, well, well, yeah, three years on YouTube in June. Um, so again, I always want to be thankful and grateful to my supporters and subscribers on here. Without you, I wouldn't be here. Fifteen stone lighter. I always say it. I can't. I can't be thankful enough for the support. Um, and the motivation and the encouragement you've provided. You're always there for me. Plenty of comments, plenty of private messages, um, plenty of followers and, on Facebook and Instagram. And as I say, if you're not already following me on Instagram, please do so because I do have more tasty little numbers uh, to give away if I can get to that 10K on Instagram. So there we go. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. If you'd like to be entered in the giveaway, please comment below. Have you got anything to say, dear? No, I'm just thinking, listening to you there. Um, are you giving away to three people or are they all going over to one? Oh, yes. Thank you. That's but okay. These things need to be said. Thank you. Uh, they will go to one lucky person. Yes one person will receive all the bars. Um, what I do is, how many do you get in a box? 20 bars. But I give it away to 60 people. Just get a bar each. Oh, you already complain about the postage. Yeah, that's true. Well, let's have a look what this one's doing. Or, we could, we could just send the empty boxes and eat the rest. Yeah, you like them, don't you? What? Yeah. Give your thoughts on the tasty little numbers bars. They're quite a tasty little number, aren't they? Yeah. So that's it from us for this week. Um, next thing you will probably see, unless I suddenly have inspiration, is the batch cook next weekend. If you do have any videos or recipes that you'd like to see, then please let me know. Um, oh, there is one more thing. Um, I have received more kind donations for my um, Snowden walk. For those of you who don't know, I will be climbing Snowden with a group of people from Instagram who have also lost weight. Uh, I think there's about 45 of us doing it and at the last count, with only 
20 or 25 people getting back to him, the weight loss amount was 147 stone. Um, so we still have more to go. Um, so between us we've lost over 150 stone and we'll be conquering another mountain by climbing Mount Snowden in, uh, to raise money for the Rainbow Trust Children's Charity. Um, my Just Giving link is below but I have had some more very kind donations and I'm now up to about £360. So to those of you who've donated since I last mentioned it, thank you very much. I'm very appreciative. Um, I never thought I'd even get the £250 that that is the required amount. So I'm very, very happy with that and thank you again for the donations. Um, so as I say, please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.